This is WJZ News at 7. Take a look at this. The tattered remains of a pride flag still hang outside the Light Street Presbyterian Church in Federal Hill. Police tell us a man went through a lot of trouble just to rip that flag in half. Hello, everybody. I'm Nikki Zizaza. And I'm Rick Ritter. Welcome to those of you watching on CBS News Baltimore and right here on WJZ. So officers tonight now calling this a hate crime as they continue to search for that suspect. WJZ live at 7 o'clock. Kelsey Kushner just outside of that church. And Kelsey, you were able to speak with one of the pastors there. Nikki, Rick, well, the pastor tells me that this man actually used this flag here to pull himself all the way up to the top. Once he reached the top, he brought out a knife and split the entire thing in half. A hate crime in the heart of Fed Hill. It is shocking. Pastor Tim Hughes Williams of Light Street Presbyterian Church says Monday afternoon a man scaled the side of their building to destroy their LGBTQ flag. He used the flag itself to climb the wall. And then when he got to the top, he pulled out a knife and started cutting it from the middle. Pastor Tim says the man told witnesses he destroyed the flag because he disagrees with what it stands for. He then hopped into the passenger side of a nearby car and drove off. To me, the violence against the flag is just reinforces how important it is that there are spaces like this. Police say they are investigating this as a hate crime and are still trying to track down the person who did it. Now, the community, or I should say, the pastor says that the community has been reaching out to them in full support. They've already received a number of donations. That money will first go towards getting a new flag put up there. The rest of it will go towards other services that support LGBTQ communities. And coming up tonight at 11, we actually speak with the man who witnessed this entire act happen. Reporting live at 7, Kelsey Krishna for WJC.